choosing. When I was little, I went to buy some clothes with my mummy. Willie came too. I can see some lovely dresses in here. Mummy said I needed a new dress and a new pair of shoes. At the dress shop, there were lots of dresses to choose from. I chose a sparkly dress. Mummy said it was very pretty for a party. But it's more pretty for a party? Mummy said I need a dress for every day to play in. Mummy showed me a red dress with pockets. I tried my new red dress. Yes, I said. I liked my new red dress. I like choosing. The next shop that we went to had a lift made of glass. I can see some pretty dresses. It was like flying. At the top of the lift we met Daddy. Hi Tig, a lovely new dress. Daddy liked my new dress. Okay then, do a fashion show. Uh -huh. Daddy bought new clothes too. Yes. You were quick choosing, said Mummy. You were very quick choosing all of that. Yeah, the man in the shop helped me. It was easy. Daddy said the man in the shop helped him choose. Let's go get the shoes. See you later. Right. Here we are. Ooh, look at, at the shoe shop, they had lots of shoes. Hi there. Hi. I liked all of the shoes. So if you want to pop your foot in. The lady had a special measuring machine for feet. The lady said my feet were growing. I couldn't see them growing. The lady said, what colour shoes do you like? Blue, I said. Then I saw a red shoe. I want the red shoe, I said. I tried on the red shoe. So they both fit, but what ones do you like? Which shoe do you like, said the lady. Red and blue. You have to choose one colour shoe or the other. I wanted both shoes. One red, one blue. Mummy said, why don't you choose blue shoes to go with your new red dress? Well, why don't you have a wee think? Both, I said. Hey, Tig, choosing can be hard. Do I have this one or do I have that one? Or do I have both? Hmm. One blue shoe and one red shoe looks fun. But when you buy shoes, you buy them in pairs. Two shoes together, two shoes that match, two shoes the same colour. So you have to choose. Two blue shoes or two red shoes. Hmm. Hey, Tig. It's difficult, isn't it? Sometimes when you are choosing, you need a bit of help. Your daddy had the man in the shop to help him choose, but you have your mummy to help you choose. Mummy said blue shoes will look good with your red dress. Well, you like blue and red together, so why not choose the blue shoes for your red dress? Go for it, Tig! Yes, I thought. I like blue and red together. I'll choose the blue shoes to go with my red dress. Good choice. The lady put my old shoes in a box. When the lady saw Willy, she nearly dropped the box. It's already a toy spider. Trying really hard. On my way home, I played no stepping on the pavement cracks in my new blue shoes. I love Willie. We've been scared since we were me. The Cloud. When I was little, my mummy took me to a big, big shopping centre. Willie came too. Mummy gave me some money. Well, let's see what I've got in my hand. <gasps> Choose something to buy, she said. A shiny penny, so you can spend that on something. There were lots and lots of shops in the shopping centre. 
I didn't know what to choose. Let's not spend it too quickly though. Let's see what else we can see. In the shopping centre, oh, there was a lady this. painting faces. She painted a little boy to look like a cat. Mummy said, why not spend your money on a painted face? No, I said. I didn't want to look like a cat. High above all the people rushing, I saw balloons. Here we go. I want to buy a balloon, I said. Hi. Let's go and find them, said Mummy. <gasps> oh, look, Tig! A man was holding the balloons. Isn't he funny, said Mummy. He's a clown. I didn't think the clown was funny. The clown was scary. He had a big rubbery face and a red nose. I didn't like the scary clown. I want to go home, I said. Come on, said Mummy. Let's have something to eat. Whee! I like the cafe. There was no clown. Mummy bought me fish fingers. Mm. Would you like some ketchup? I had tomato sauce. Down below I saw the clown. The clown looked up and waved. I don't like clowns. Hey Tig, you don't have to like clowns. Clowns are just people with painty faces. Anybody can be a clown. You could be a clown. I could be a clown. Some people think clowns are scary. Some people think clowns are funny. <laughs> Look, that painty faced clown is making everyone laugh. Hey Tig, why don't you be a painty faced clown and make everyone laugh too? Go for it, Tig. Yes, I thought. I want to be a painty face clown too. Let's go. I finished my fish fingers. I asked Mummy if I could give my money to the face painting lady. I see you doing ever so well. The face painting lady painted my face like a clown. Oh wow, hey. that's a sparkle. I think you're a very funny clown. Thank you very much. Mummy laughed and everyone laughed when they saw me looking like a painty face clown. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the clown. He wasn't scary. He looked just like me. The clown gave me a balloon. When the clown saw Willy, he was scared. <laughs> He's only my toy spider, I said. I like clowns. I love Willy. We've been scared since we were Supermarkets. When I was little, I went shopping with my mummy to a supermarket. Yes, and you'll see and you'll get a really good view. Yes. What do you think we should get for Daddy? Willie came too. Does he really like chocolate? The supermarket was big. The supermarkets sold everything. Yes. Ironing boards. Ironing, Ironing boards. Toasters. Televisions. Washing machines. We didn't buy a washing machine. Mummy wanted food. I told Mummy where to find things. Carrots. Carrots. A cabbage. Potatoes. Tomatoes. Onions. A melon. A big melon. That's a heavy one. Oh. Apples. Oranges. Bananas. I'll pop them in the back there. Grapefruit. Two. Two. Yeah, let's get two. And a pineapple. 
The pink ones. The pink ones. I didn't want to be in a trolley seat. Yeah, yeah, no, but what are you going to do? Tell me what you're going to Stay do. Stay next to you. Stay next to me all the time. Good girl. Mummy said to keep close and hold onto the trolley. <laughs> Can you manage? I helped Mummy put things into the trolley. Oh Milk. You're so strong. Mummy pushed the trolley. That's lots and lots of toys. I saw a fire engine. The fire engine had a ladder on top. I picked up the fire engine to show Mummy. When I looked, Mummy wasn't there. Tag. I ran down all the shelves and looked round the corner. Mummy wasn't there. Where was Mummy? I looked down some more shelves and some more shelves. No Mummy. I thought Mummy had left me. Mum, where are you? I thought I was all by myself. Then I saw Willy. Hi, I've lost my daughter. We're just in the toy section. Willy hadn't left me. Hey, Tig, Mummy hasn't left you, and Mummy hasn't run away. Mummy will be looking for you right now. Mummy loves you. Mummy will be just as worried as you are. You've just lost each other for a moment, that's all. When you ran up that way, Mummy was just behind you. Yes. But when you turned the corner, Mummy didn't know which way you'd gone. You both keep moving around and missing each other. What a laugh! So the best thing for you to do is stay in one spot, here by the fire engines and me. Mummy will tell the store people and they will find you in no time. So we'll stay here and Mummy will come round the corner any minute. I waited in the one place. <gasps> Tig! And Mummy came round the corner. <laughs> I was so happy to see Mummy. <laughs> Willie had a ride. The man was surprised to see Willie. <gasps> I got my toy spider. Right. Off we go. I love my mummy. I love Willie!